Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today, um, I want to do like a chit chat, get ready with me. So I was thinking about doing gold eyes or like a bright lip. So yeah, let's get started. So the first thing I'll be using is the e.l.f. Hydrate Primer. And I really love this one. You know what I love this one? If you saw my, um, ride or die, um, video, you know I love this stuff. And then it is my sister that just walked in. And so, that was primer. Now, I'm going to start with concealer. I'm just going to take, um, wait, I will start with eyes. Never mind. Okay. So, I think I'm going to use Morphe brushes, 45E palette. And, yes, I took some eyeshadows out to make a custom palette. Uh, so yeah, I think I want to use this all over again. So let's just start. So first, we obviously always gotta start off our base colors. So we take. I'm just gonna find a base color. I just take any old palette and just find a base color. I think I'm gonna use the Naked Smoky Pop because I haven't used this in a while, and I take that color called Thirteen, and I'm just gonna take that and put it all over my lid. The brow bone and under the under eye circles. And then I really, and then I think I'm gonna do a crease color. I'm gonna use Fenty and Converse mixed together and use that to crease. I wanna find this is a small brush, so yeah, I'm just gonna take Fenty and Converse. Mainly, um, I for the um whiskey. I've never tried this out, guys. Ooh, that's dark. And this is a back to work for the brush, by the way. Okay, so this looks too messy. Let's just get like um the brush I originally came with this palette and just use it to blend out everything. So it doesn't look too messy. And then let's get back with the Morphe brushes color, um, contour, um, eyeshadow palette. And I'm gonna use that. I'm gonna use that gold color, and I'm gonna put that on my lid. Wow, this is bigger than. I definitely recommend Morphe palettes. They're so pigmented. So pretty, it's so gorgeous. They're just like well, I'm sorry, I'm looking over there it's because it's from Vivienne's. That single color. Oh, I see a lot. The more fair shows I hate is that they don't have names. So you just need the color and say, "Oh, this is like that." I'm so bad at describing it, guys. So you get that same brown color and just use some silver eyeshadow and put it on my under eye. Okay, so that's what the eye look like. Do you guys like it? As much as I do? Comment down below. Okay, so let's get back on the face. I'm gonna use this. Adri my concealer and Maybelline and using my finger to just put it under my eye under your eyes. Some people don't really like this, but I do. I think it's a great concealer. Some people don't like it because they don't they say it's not thick. Which I can totally understand that I feel like thick concealers, but I don't actually care I don't have like 
breakouts or nothing, so I'll just be here anyway. This video is going quick, y'all. <laughs> Which I want it to be. Split that under my eyes. I always think it cover kind of my dark circles, which I kind of, I really do my dark circles every day now. Yeah. And then I'm going to take my little Santa powder. And I'm going to take a big powder brush and just set my face. You know how I did that Ride or Die video? You saw that? And you saw that I put a favorite foundation. It was because I was supposed to, but I don't really use foundation. But I still have to have it too if I really want to. But yeah, some things I just don't feel like it. So just I like to pack it in my screen so it makes it set throughout the day. If you work a lot, I set the count. <laughs> now for the grand finale contour. I love contour, and you only need a little bit because if you put like a lot on the brush, it will see. I also that's a little bit. So it's really this is like a thick brush. You don't even see it like get on the brush kind of, but we kind of see it. But it really brings out the contour and colors the jawline people. As you all know, I love coloring my jawline. <laughs> I'm gonna take that powder brush. I always like one of my contour has one of the powder brush. I don't need extreme contour because it's I'm only ten and I the reason why I wear makeup is because it it's just awesome and fun and I like to collect it. Which I do have a lot of makeup actually. You probably don't believe me. I'm gonna take that same crystal sense brush and I'm gonna take a little bit of it and use it as nose contour. Okay, so that's my nose contour. Then time for blush. Okay, I've been, I love this blush a lot, and if you saw my Mariah Carey review, you know, uh, I, I thought it was for Dark Sigma, so that's why I didn't like it. It's the Mariah Carey Back Pink, um, you got me feeling blush. And I'm going to take a, this unicorn brush, and just blow it, because it doesn't really show up that much on my skin. And I just swirl on my cheeks. So that's my blush. Now I think I'm gonna do some brows and then color her. And then my highlight. This is my favorite brow pencil, it's by ColourPop. Bagan or Bootsy, I don't know what it's called, but you can just look up a reference. You don't need to get my shade. Pick the shade that is good for you. What I like to do with my brows is I like to comb them first. And then what I like to do is brush them out and make them kind of hang. Um, do that because it makes them look more hairy, not like blocks. The brows. So then we'll get some mascara on and highlighting. I'm gonna use the Too Faced Born This Way mascara. This is my Ride or Die mascara, by the way, for right now. And then. I'm going to put some highlight off. 
This is kind of dried out a little bit, so it's not gonna give you like two full lashes. And the highlighting and then oops. Sorry, like talking to this because I don't want this video to be too long because I don't like doing long videos, y'all. So what I'm gonna have to do is take the I guess I broke the lid off. <laughs> it's easy to break a stroke door flat. It's the you know I love this so much. It's the Wild Wild Highlighting Gold Bar. But in its limited edition. And it's my favorite highlighter like ever. I'm usually not a fan of blue highlights, but I love this one so much. See all that tape there, y'all? Ooh. Let's pour off. So I could do the highlights now. There goes. I'm just kidding, bro. That looks like a uh, like contour. <laughs> a little bit. So, gonna, I think we're gonna do so little lips, and I think we'll be done. Or no. That was a shine of my eyes. It's not like it's, called, it's the BH Cosmetics on matte lip. 48 color lipstick. And it's like every lip color. I'm going to use. I'm going to mix these two bright corals together and we'll see what it turns out like. Oh, I'm going to take those two coral, col col coral colors, these two. I'm just going to create a beautiful coral. By the way, these are not mad, like I said. So this is a completed look, and here's a close-up of the look. Close-up of the lip color, close-up of the eyes. And, and yeah. Highlighting. So, I hope you all enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye!